good morning so today is saturday i'm not actually gonna vlog to you today i'm just gonna let you know what we're up to so my neighbor is a head teacher and she's asked if i'll go and take photographs at her school's rugby tournament <laughs> so we'll see how that goes um, I mean, like, I have no idea what I'm looking for. Like, children don't prick their ears forwards, or like, I don't know, throw them the forehand, or yeah, I don't know. So, I'm not gonna vlog it because you guys aren't interested in rugby, I see. And for obvious reasons, I can't really vlog it anyway at school. But yeah, so I'll get in touch with you tomorrow when we're doing something a little bit more up your street and up my street, actually. Good morning again. So today is Sunday. It's seven o'clock and we're heading over to Mill Lane near Selby for their winter dressage series. So we did quite a lot of these last year. Um, I think we did four or five last year. Um, this year when Vicky sent me the dates I only actually had two left all year. So we've got this one then we've got one in a few weeks I think as well. So, but it's a, we really like Mill Lane. It's really nice that um, people are really nice. Um, it's really well organised. Um, chips at the cafe are amazing. The only thing is, is that the first test is at half past eight. <laughs> so it's an early one. So it takes us about an hour to get there. And then we need like an hour to set up. 45 minutes. But um, at Mill Lane they have like a viewing area. Which is quite big where they drop the tests and stuff off. And um, that's where we set up the table. So we don't need to take trailer, don't need to take the gazebo. So yeah, that's winning at life really. Because um, you can just hop in the car and head over there with our stuff. So you still have the stuff in the car yesterday from rugby. Um, yeah let's not talk about rugby <laughs> um i'm glad to be taking photographs of horses again today to say the least um it's just not the same is it so yes so we're gonna head over there um i'll try to give you a little tour when we get there um because we should have plenty of time to do that today in theory but we will see so it's freezing cold this morning to put lots of layers on but it is it's cold <laughs> but we're indoors so the wind is a little bit windy that shouldn't bother us too much but that indoor is always as cold if not a bit colder than the outside so lots of layers today <laughs> okay so I'll talk to you in a little bit when I get there
car across the floor. We are just leaving. Um, really good day at dressage. Really well supported, but they always are here. Um, some really nice tests. Some really nice horses. Um, yeah, we love it here. Chips for lunch and like the chips here. I know I, I mentioned it earlier, but literally like people are like <laughs> you're fine. People are like they know about it like how, how famous are the mill lane chips they're really they're so good yeah so good they're like legendary and everyone like I think when I tell mum that we're coming here if we're coming showing or something she's like oh is that the one with the chips <laughs> yeah, they're good they're good so I can't believe how dark it is like you won't get so like that's how dark it is already and it's literally 20 past 4 which is not cool and it's gonna be below freezing tonight. So we are gonna go now, drive home, put the ponies in and bring them in because I'm a little bit worried it's gonna be a bit frosty. And then we are gonna get these photographs uploaded. Okay, so last night I was gonna show you the um, ponies, but they're on the naughty set last night because they trashed the electric fence and got into the bottom field. As you can see, it's considerably greener than... I mean, they have two fields, like, they just do it because it's naughty. Um, <laughs> so, it's seven o'clock, been up since, like, half six, dropped down off in Weatherby. And now I've got to rebuild the electric fence. Um, they've probably... I mean, it had a battery on it, it's probably died. So, I'll redo the electric fence. <laughs> um, I've got... They were in last night because it was supposed to be frosty but it didn't end up being frosty in the end. So I've got to <laughs> rebuild the fence, do the field, then I'll go and do the stables. And I think I might take Brian out for a drive. So this is Cand. Cand. Who, yeah, is probably responsible for breaking the fence, aren't you? That was probably you. She's sort of in the escape missions. She's the ringleader, aren't you? Hey, are you antisocial? <laughs> so I'm gonna put her out in the field. Um, I'm gonna get print out. I'm gonna take her for a little drive. So I'll pop her out. Go out in the field. What do you think? No trashing fences today, though, please. Hmm. You don't even care, do you? <laughs> Just gonna check if her handy works still. On the floor. Not impressed that someone's fixed it. So this is Prinlim. He's shy. Is he going for a little drive? So I drive her in a Liverpool bit, which some ponies don't like. But I just have it on the Lisa string, so that it's basically just like having a snaffle. She's really, really soft mouth. She's all tucked up, ready to go. So I'm going for a spin. She doesn't look very enthusiastic this morning. But I think as soon as she realises we're going out, she'll be a bit more giddy, won't you? Because driving's like a favourite thing ever. Right. I could do the blipper, really, couldn't I? Oh, she's off. Friend, stand. Okay, so just gonna go. I'm not going to go far this morning because she's... um. I haven't driven her since like August last year and she's bride and drive so she's done a bit more riding recently not with me but um my fitness isn't great she's been going out walks to keep her going but I haven't driven her much she's keen aren't you so change of plan I'm gonna drive but Got her all harnessed up, ready to go, and we had a splat. 
tire so it'll just need a bit of air in it because it's been stood for a long time i've not used it and it's my fault really I should have checked before i started getting it all out and tacking her up but um it's already like it's taken me ages to get stuffed in this morning it's just been one of those mornings and it's not even half eight yet so i got quite a lot to do this morning in there so i was just gonna take for a little stroll out but now we're just gonna have to long grain and make it a bit quick but i suppose it's better for me to be walking than sat a bit of exercise so just gonna take a quick stroll down the lane and then i'll be heading in do a bit of get everything sorted for this morning and then i'll start editing the blog blog a blog so it can be online tomorrow evening as normal so thank you for watching if you've enjoyed it next week's actually quite an interesting one um we're going to three places next week um with work so that's exciting so we're going got something really exciting on thursday i'm going to keep that as a surprise um and then got a shoot day at a yard on Saturday and then on Sunday welcome we've got a dressage competition again we seem to be doing a lot of dressage at the minute but yeah this next next week's will be a lot more varied so that should be good so thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next week